I clear, I can't anytime this is like chips or hoa. Anytime I dig in, I'm getting meat. Mm. Today, I'm going to call this the cooking vlog. Today, I'm going to make some homemade pot pie. And the ingredients that you'll need for this will be chicken. I'm using chicken breast, but you can use whatever chicken you want. I like to get the biscuits because I just like the way these biscuits taste. You can get whatever one you want, or you can be clever enough to make your own little crust. I don't know, but I like to use the biscuits, got some pepper, some cream of chicken, Campbell's, we all remember Campbell's. You know, you're gonna need your pan and your mixed vegetables. You also gonna need two pots. One pot for the chicken and the other pot for the vegetables. I prefer to cook my chicken a little bit, not long, just enough. And then put, oh, another thing I forgot, chicken bouillon. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is take the chicken and just let it boil for about a good 20, 30 minutes. All I'm gonna put in here is, you know, some water, the bouillon cubes, some pepper, and a little bit of salt, and the rest of my little seasoning. Let that boil, like I said, for about 20 minutes. I'm also gonna put the mixed vegetables into this pot, and let that cook while this is cooking. I want it to feel like ratatouille. You know, I had explosions in this. Yeah, that's what I wanted. But anyway, so I'm gonna get that prepared. And uh, let's get this, let's get this going. So you're cooking right now. Cooking with your big head boy. Gotta love it. I got the chicken in the pot here. Let that cook, like I said, for about 20 minutes. And I got it on a medium high, so it'll go kind of quick. And then here, I have the mixed vegetables. Let that cook for a while in the water. Then after it, you know, it gets a little cooked, take the water off of it and put the soup, the cream of chicken soup inside there. All right, so now I got the biscuits. I put these, I put about six biscuits in the pan. Like I said, it's the grains. And sprayed a little bit of parquet on them. So I can use the spoon to kind of press them down, flatten them out around the base of the pan. That way to let me know how much space it covers the pan. All right, so this is before. This is after. So I got it spread out pretty decent. Um, it's covering it pretty decent. I'm not worried about the little holes in it because just let some of the juices get up in there and soak that bread. You know what I mean? I mean, I got a couple of more left in the pack. A few more left in a couple more left in it. So if I wanted to drop two, you know, one right over this hole and then one right over that hole would be perfectly fine. Pretty much ready. I'm going to strain them and let it cook more with the cream of cream of chicken soup. So I got the vegetables all strained off from the water and 
Now I'm gonna mix the cream. A chicken soup. And there you have it, official big head idea, some homemade pot roast, uh, pot, not pot roast, but homemade chicken pot pot. Yeah. Well, here we go. Next time, I think I might put rice in it. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Homemade pot pie. That's it. <laughs> I got my homemade pot pie. And here I go. <laughs> I don't like trying my food first that I make. But here we go. <laughs> yeah. That's on point. That's on point. I got my sweet tea here. So, thank you for joining me on, on this cooking. I don't know what to call it, but hey, today I cooked something, something different. I've never tried this before. I like doing stuff like that. Like, last Thanksgiving, I tried something I ain't never heard before, but I like, I like sweet potato pie and I like cheesecake. So, and usually I make, you know, sweet potato pies for Thanksgiving. This year, I made sweet potato pie and I made sweet potato pie cheesecake. I just had to use my own, no recipes, just my own knowledge. And it came out pretty good. So the second time, it's going to be even better. You know, when I make it next time, I'll probably do it the same way I did this. But anyway, thank you. I'm about to grub. Good food. Good meat. Thank God. Let's see. Got nothing but love for y'all. Thank y'all for tuning in. And as I say on everyone, 
peace and blessings to all.